This is Roland from Recompose. Today, I'm going to take you through the piano roll in Liquid Notes. Whenever you open up a project in Liquid Notes, your main interface is going to look somewhat like this. Chords are represented as rectangular boxes, with the chord symbol sitting on top of that box. The track view is being shown on top of the user interface and stretching the entire length. The zoom bar, represented here in blue, shows the selection that you have made for the main interface just underneath it. To select the piano roll, click on the tab here, which brings out the piano roll with the MIDI events for the different instruments in your arrangement being represented in different color on the timeline. Once again, this is only shown for the zoom level of the arrangement that you see down here. Whenever you make a change to a chord, like we're doing this here right now, you can see the changes have taking place up here in the piano roll for that particular instrument. So once more. This allows you to actually get a very clear view on what is happening on a single note level in liquid notes. It gives you a better understanding about how music theory is being built up and what does it mean in this case for your arrangement. So whenever you want to get to know more about what it is that Liquid Notes changes on your arrangement, just select the piano roll from the tab up here and you'll be gladly served by our software. Thanks for watching.